Okay, welcome to our next exercise, which is continued development of flams and drags. So th this one's in jig rhythm. So it's like jig rhythm, flams and drags. So let's find it. I think it's this one. Yep. Here we are. So continue development, flam and drag, compound time. All right, so we're playing jig rhythms here. All right, and I'm able to get the whole page up on the screen, which is handy. So it'll be, I like to call these trampoline taps that are between these flams, because when you play the tap, it's not an accent, but you need to play it low. But once you've played it, you've got to ping it up. So it's almost like it's got a trampoline boing, and it's going up. Reason for it going up is not for volume, it's for the next flam. So you're getting flam tap, flam tap, flam tap, flam tap, flam. And it's that moving over and over again that we're trying to get. So if you've never done that before, you could try that, right? But maybe not try it in jig time. Don't be going three, four, because that'll confuse you. All right, play it in like a simple time rhythm. Jack, 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 like this. Three, four. Try that. Three, four. Two, three, four. So remember the tap that you see. Is going to be bouncing up. You play it low and then it needs to ping up once you've played it. Two, three, four. And one more. Three, four. And all I'm doing there is that rhythm starting on the little right flam. You could do the same. You start it on the left. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. Okay, and you would need to do the same for drags, okay? So you could try them. So start with a right drag. And it's the same idea. The tap's going to ping up. Three, four. And one more. And then I'll try it on the left. So left drag first. Two, three, four. And a couple more. Two, three, four. Done. And you'll see that's the rhythm we're playing there. We're doing it in jig time. So instead of tick, 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 in jig time, you get this. Tick, 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 and then it'll be tick, 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 one, two, three, or two, two, three, two a day, even, sorry, Jesus. On your second line, you're doing the same flam rhythm, you're just putting a tap in front of it. So you're, instead of, you're getting, and it just moves it off the beat slightly. It's much and such the exact same rhythm. In fact, it is the exact same rhythm. It's just moving slightly off the beat, all right, which is enough to mess with your head a little bit. So I'm going to try, yeah, I'm going to try all of this. All right, because the first phrase or first two bars and the next two bars are the exact same. All right, so you'll be and then you repeat it and then on the repeat you would stop after that left tap unless the assessor has asked you to play the page top to bottom. If they have, then you have to play it top to bottom. Okay, so let's try it. Two, three, four, front, 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 very relaxed. Very chilled out. And then I will put the metronome on it. will be a little bit brighter. Two, three, four. Repeated. Right, let's see how it feels with the metronome. So it's a bit brighter here. We'll try it. Two, three, four. And again, if you're uncomfortable with that brighter tempo, then 
sit and practice at the slower one a bit more. Let's try the faster one again. Worth the repeat. One, two, go. Done. And then our second line, we're putting the tap in first. So again, it's much and such the same rhythm. You're just going to be tap. And doing the tap ends up leading you on to the opposite hands. Okay, so you're actually playing this first two bars the same as the second two bars, but they're on the opposite hands. So if you follow it, you'll be this. Three, four, tap. stop on that left tap okay let's try it I'm gonna pull it back just a little bit and we'll try to play that repeated two three four worth noting as well this first tap Right, that you play on the right, that throws a lot of folk. That's going to be one of those trampoline taps that I talked about. That's not the official name for it. All right, I've, that's <laughs> I've made up, okay? So you're going to play that tap and ping it up. Okay, if you catch that, chances are extremely high you'll fall into the river. And then that left tap here is the same. That's going to be one of those trampoline taps. So you'll be... Okay, so let's try that again at that slower speed. Two, three, four. Go to the repeat. Done. And then at a faster tempo, you'll be here. And it might take a bit of time to get to the speed. Two, three, four. And I'll do it again. One, two, three, four. Done. And now we move on to drags. So you'll be the same as we've done at the start. The only difference is you're going to do a tap at the end. And then it's the same here. The only difference is a tap at the end instead of the one, two, three. But you're going to do it with drags. So you'll be. Okay. Drag, tap, drag, tap, drag, tap, drag, tap, drag, tap. So it's still trampoline taps. Okay. Up, up to there. And then you're going to do the same on the opposite hand. All right. So let's try that. Really chilled out. Two, three, four. And then left. Repeated. And then left. Okay. And I will do that one again. Um, what makes this one easier is keeping the drags really low. All right, don't be there. All right, because a loud drag, in my opinion, just sounds honking. It sounds like <coughs> when you do it on a drum. <coughs> and that's not me saying it sounds poop. That's what it physically sounds like. <coughs> <laughs> it's, it's not a great sound. Okay. So let's try it again. Two, three, four. And then swap. And then repeat. And swap. Grand. So let's try it with the beeps. You'll be here. Ready? Two, three, four. And yeah, this one's going to maybe take a bit of practice and get up to this speed. Do it. Just practice it. Two. Three, four. Done. 
And as I said there, rewind the video back. Even if it's just rewinding it back 10 seconds, you've got the mouse, all right? If you're playing this on the YouTube channel or in the classroom or whatever it is you're playing it, put the mouse where that bit is, click, play it, click, play it, click, play it, all right? Just keep doing it, all right, until you're comfortable and confident with it as we move on to the last line. So same idea as the second one. All right, it's tap drags instead of tap flam. And then instead of doing flam left, right, you're just going to finish with a drag. And then you're doing the same in the opposite hand. So you'll be... Okay, so you get this. Have a listen. Three, four. And then you swap. So all the taps before the drags are still those trampoline taps. Let's try it. Two, three. Four. Repeated. Done. And we'll do it again. Two, three, four. Try it with the peeps and again give it a go if it's wild play it slower so it'll be here ready two three four and again two three four Play along to that as often as you need to. So I'm going to play the whole page now um, at the slower speed and then I'll crank it up. So I'll play it here. Whoa. Lost my stick. Oh, geez. Oh. We'll play it. Um, there. Top to bottom. Two, three, four. Repeat it. And then swap it for jazz. Done. Right, let's do it again, but with the beeps. So it'll be here. Ready? Top to bottom, whole page. Two, three, four. Next line. Again, I mean this one it's not as fast as things like the the Ratama cues, but it's a bit more awkward, especially with drags alright being the opposite hand and they are a bit tricky. If they're really, really awkward for you and you're really struggling, practice things like Mummy Daddies where you're doing a mummy daddy drag bus, mummy daddy, mummy daddy, mummy daddy. Exercises like that, and that's quite chilled out. That's sped up. I mean, you can play them inside out, upside down. You could sit and do that, and then maybe swap it over. You could go, Mummy, Daddy, Mummy, Daddy. Uh, so it's reversing rounds. You can really play about with them. But certainly, 
doing that. So you're going one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. I'm just making that up in terms of rhythms. You could crank it up. You should end up with quite good drag control after that. Okay, so that was continued development of flam and drag. Next exercise will be flam doubles, which leads to windmills.